The Cairo Metro, also known as Metro El Cairo in Arabic, has undergone a remarkable evolution since its inauguration in 1987. This transformative transportation system has played a crucial role in connecting various neighborhoods and improving urban mobility in the bustling city of Cairo. Let's delve into the detailed timeline of the Cairo Metro's development from 1987 to its projected future in 2024. Highlighting key milestones, line extensions, and notable station names along the way. The Cairo Metro had its grand opening on September 27, 1987, with the inauguration of Line 1, also referred to as the El Marg Helwan Line. This inaugural line marked the birth of the Cairo Metro system and covered a substantial distance of 44.3 kilometers. With a total of 35 stations, Line 1 provided a much-needed transportation solution for commuters traveling between the neighborhoods of El Marg and Helwan. Notable stations along this line included Nasser, Sadat, and Ataba, serving as important transportation hubs within the city. Continuing its expansion efforts, the Cairo Metro made its first significant extension to Line 1 in 1989. This extension added three additional stations, namely Shoada, Gamra, and Demerdash. The introduction of these stations enhanced connectivity and accessibility for commuters traveling through these densely populated areas. In 1995, Cairo's transportation landscape saw the inauguration of Line 2, also known as the Shubra El Khaima Munib Line. This new line stretched from Shubra El Khaima to Munib, covering a distance of 21.6 kilometers. Featuring 20 stations, Line 2 provided a vital connection for residents and commuters in these areas. Notable stations on Line 2 included Shubra El Khaima, Martyrs, and the iconic Tahrir Square, a significant landmark in Cairo. Line 1 continued its expansion efforts with subsequent extensions over the years. In 1996, three new stations were added to Line 1, El Malek El Saleh, Al Sayeda Zainab, and Saad Zaglul. These additions aim to meet the growing demand and facilitate smoother travel experiences for passengers, Then, in 1997, two more stations, Mar Gurgis and El Zara, were introduced, further improving connectivity within the Cairo Metro network. The year 2000 marked another milestone in the development of Line 1. This significant expansion added five new stations, namely Heliopolis, Cairo Stadium, Koliet El Banat, Street 9, and El Aram. These additional stations facilitated easier access to key areas and landmarks, catering to the needs of commuters and contributing to the city's overall transportation infrastructure. In 2012, Cairo Metro witnessed the inauguration of Line 3, commonly known as the Airport Line. This line provided a direct connection between the city center and Cairo International Airport a major transportation hub serving both domestic and international travelers. Line 3 covered a substantial distance of 48 kilometers and featured 30 stations, including Salah Salem, Adli Mansour, and the Cairo International Airport station itself. This addition significantly enhanced convenience for commuters traveling to and from the airport, contributing to Cairo's status as a global city. Looking to the future, the Cairo Metro is poised for further expansion by 2024. Line 1 is expected to undergo significant extensions, stretching from Helwan to New Cairo. This ambitious expansion plan will cover an approximate distance of 35 kilometers, adding multiple stations such as El Mahdi, Ring Road, and New Cairo to the network. By 2024, Line 2 of the Cairo Metro is also scheduled to undergo substantial extensions, further enhancing its reach and connectivity. The planned extensions will stretch the line from Munib to Cairo International Stadium, covering an approximate distance of 7 kilometers. This extension will include the addition of several stations, including Haroon, Al Ali Sporting Club, and the Cairo International Stadium Station. These expansions aim to improve transportation options for residents in eastern Cairo and provide easier access to major sports and entertainment venues. 
Additionally, Line 3 is set to receive extensions, with the goal of connecting it to the western part of the city. The planned extensions will stretch from Cairo International Airport to Mbaba, covering a distance of approximately 17 kilometers. This expansion will introduce new stations such as Sphinx, Haram, and Mbaba, further integrating the airport with other parts of Cairo, and facilitating convenient travel for residents and tourists. Furthermore, Line 4, also known as the Ring Road Line, is scheduled to be constructed as part of the Cairo Metro's future development plans. This line aims to encircle the city, providing a seamless circular route for commuters. The proposed Line 4 will have a total length of approximately 78 kilometers and is expected to connect various neighborhoods and key transportation hubs, promoting efficient travel and reducing congestion in the city center. By 2024, the Cairo Metro is projected to have a comprehensive network spanning a total distance of approximately 200 kilometers. This extensive metro system will offer commuters a reliable and efficient mode of transportation, connecting different parts of the city and easing traffic congestion. With well-designed stations, modern trains, and improved connectivity, the Cairo Metro will continue to play a crucial role in enhancing urban mobility and contributing to the sustainable development of Cairo.